Coach, if you would, please introduce your two student athletes and tell us a little bit about them. Okay, uh, we've got Kendall Joseph. Uh, this is our starting middle linebacker, number 34. Uh, he is uh, an unbelievable leader for us. Uh, he's a captain of our football team, uh, fifth year senior, and uh, has been, a, I guess, a three year starter. A very, very talented and dynamic young man. He's a graduate. Uh, hopefully he'll have opportunity to play some ball in the NFL, but he's already got a really, really nice job uh, waiting on him if he, if he chooses to do that. Uh, he's from uh, Belton, BHP High School in South Carolina, and, and again, just a, a great leader and have been a very productive player. And then Hunter Renfro, uh, yep, that's Hunter Renfro, for those of you who don't know him. Uh, uh, he's a fifth-year receiver as well. Uh, he's from down in uh, Myrtle Beach, Socastee area in South Carolina. Uh, uh, same thing, a graduate, he's a captain, uh, just an uh, amazing young man, uh, both from great families and uh, one of the most uh, productive receivers we've ever had at Clemson. Uh, he's got the most starts ever for a receiver, most catches consecutively uh, in, 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 a, in the history of Clemson, just very productive football player. And uh, again, two great leaders and representatives of our program. Thank you, Coach. We're going to go to questions for Kendall and Hunter. Please raise your hand. We'll get our microphone guys to you. <clears throat> On your left. Hunter, how, how much more dynamic do you think this offense is this year compared to a year ago when you guys were entering semifinal? Yeah, um, just a little different, uh, a, a little more experienced, I would say. Um, we still have Justin outside uh, that's a freshman and, and a few more freshman uh, pieces. But I would say just the experience we have and, and just being on that team last year um, and not finishing the way we wanted to, I think it's definitely going to help us uh, as we finish, hopefully, well this year. On the right. Chuck Carlton, Dallas Morning News for Hunter as well. When you went through the quarterback switch, what was that like? And what has Trevor brought to the offense yeah. as a fresh? And does he play like a freshman now? Or could you describe him to us? Yeah. Um, that, that quarterback switch seemed like uh, three years ago. I mean, it seems like uh, so much time has passed. But I would say that, yeah, I mean, Trevor's had 13 games under his belt. And so um, he's a freshman, I guess, still. Uh, but he plays like a sophomore. Um, he's had a whole year under his belt. And he's really just gotten better every week. And that's the thing I would say about Trevor is every week he's came and he's gotten better. Uh, and, and just seeing his preparation from week to week, uh, I got to spend some time with him in the quarterback room. And so just see from the third week to the fourth week to the fifth week, uh, just how he slowed everything down, how he was able to process everything, and really just command the attention of the team. I think after, uh, after Kelly left, uh, it was just a, a, a big improvement. Uh, from that standpoint, Trevor kind of getting all the guys together and, and leading the charge. Okay, at this point, we'll let our student athletes uh, get out to practice and we will continue with questions for Coach.